Hey guys, I am outside with my little Toby and Buddy is running down to the house and Michael just came out. He had to go get the keys so we could go get in to the shop so we can get our gardening supplies because today we are going to garden and I will show y'all around the garden a little bit. All right, we're in here now. We have red potatoes along that row in the back, like back here. Then we have white potatoes running down there. And it goes all the way down to the end of the garden. And over here on this row, right here on down is peppers. And then we got the wayside right here, what I'm walking on, so that I'm not stepping on any plants. Uh, then the corn. And the dogs decided they were going to join me in the garden. <laughs> we got this little, this little plant right there. I'm in the sunlight. That little plant right there, buddy, is some corn. And then over here on... Hold on. Let me get over here. Over here on this row that Buddy's standing in, right here, is going to be tomatoes up there, okra, cucumber, something here. I can't remember what all we got. Squash. Squash. And behind me will be cantaloupe. And Mr. Michael has come. Bringing the plants. So we're going to have to plant this box, which these are mostly tomatoes and squash, I believe. Yeah, and squash. As you can see, during the summer and during the spring, we do a lot of gardening. As you can see from my first vlog, we were walking around looking at trees because we do plan on planting more trees. We want to do, like I said in the vlog, uh, <clears throat> pecan and peach because we have a peach tree and we have an apple tree we need to buy two more apples and another peach or I think he said he wanted two more peaches and we want another pecan because we have a pecan this is our peach you see it's really small we planted it last year so it's still kind of small. And this apple tree over here is a bit... I don't know if it's going to come back to life or not. I think that really bad freeze that we got just a few... Oh, it's starting to bud, actually. Yeah. Yeah, it's starting to bud. Awesome. Yeah. I like that. That's nice. So, it's still alive. That's a plus because I thought this was dying. But we do need another apple. Because we did have another peach and another apple. And I probably just covered up the camera. I'm sorry. Um, but both of them got ran over by the tractor. <coughs> so we are going to have to replant some. So, and we're wanting to plant a willow somewhere in the yard. Not too, too sure. I don't know. We're going to figure that out. But, uh, you know, just kind of, kind of spruce up the yard a little bit. Vlogging. <laughs> Showing them our apples and our peach tree. Okay. But, uh, buddy. Buddy. What's you doing? You playing with your bottle? You playing with your bottle? Oh, are you playing with your bottle? Are you excited about that? <laughs> That's little buddy. You so buddy, bud. Say hi, buddy. Say hi to everybody. Uh, no, on the camera. <laughs> there ain't nobody else here except for me and your daddy. And then we have these little trees. One of them, I think, is a crepe myrtle. I think that one's a crepe myrtle. I have no idea what this one is. But let's just say they've gotten so much bigger 
since we first put them in the ground. I don't know where Toby ran off to. <laughs> what pretty boy? What you doing? I think most of this vlog is just going to be talking about plants and showing Buddy. <laughs> showing Buddy off. But, uh, yeah, we just, uh, waiting for Michael to get done. He had to run inside real quick and do a few things. So, I'm waiting for him to kind of come outside. Kind of come outside, yeah. I'm waiting for him to come outside so that we can start on the garden. And I have no idea where, if I had Buddy's ball out here, it would be funny. <laughs> what are you doing? You're sitting so funny. Hey. You want it? <coughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, there's fat boy. <laughs> and our picnic table. <laughs> You're so cute. But trust me, not all of these vlogs are going to be like... Not all of these vlogs vlogs are going to be about gardening it's just that right now our our life is gardening right now getting the garden ready we got the whole diggers out there's henry there's little henry i just have a fly fly on me he has no head right now but we will be making a new body for him and fixing him up somewhere a little nicer where he's not laying down because that's not scaring the deer and the rabbits off which sad story a lot of my friends already know this but I will walk back here um it's gruesome the story is so that's a warning so if you're like not into poor animal stories and gruesome gruesome tales then you might not want to watch this you might want to skip ahead a little bit but uh Right here, in the hole of the fence, you can see all this fuzz, and fuzz on the fence, a little rabbit got eaten by a fox, and I found half of its body, the bottom half, sticking out of the fence, so it's kind of, kind of a sad little story. I was very heartbroken because as most of y'all know I am a huge animal lover but I got to remember too that we live in a world where it's survival of the fittest so that rabbit got spooked and the fox wanted wanted the rabbit <laughs> so I have to remember everybody has to eat everything has to eat so it was just it's time and it was time for that poor little rabbit to go and it was time for that little fox to eat but we did get to see the fox um one night michael had come home and i had just found it that day and i just left it there because i was like you know a lot of people were like oh why'd you leave it why why didn't you get it why didn't you you know take it out of the fence and put it somewhere or bury it and i'm like because it's something something else's meal it's another animal's meal and i don't want you know i want every animal to be able to eat and survive so i just left it there and michael had came home from work that night and found and we drove up there in the mustang and the fox was standing down in here and we just kind of was like, okay, well, it's eating, so we're just going to leave it alone. And Buddy was in the car, and he freaked out. Like, like whining and crying. and rrr, rrr, Like, oh, I want to get at him. And I'm like, yeah, that would not be a good idea for you, Buddy. <laughs> but it was a very healthy fox. It was very fluffy and very nice, so I'm just like, you know, it's, it's healthy. It's surviving, so that's good. But, uh. Like I said, a lot of people are like, oh, why did you do that? And I'm like, I'm sorry. I, everybody has to eat. But Toby, I almost called you buddy. Yeah, 
as your little baby. Where are you going? <laughs> oh, but yeah, so that happened. My phone is still going off. But I've talked to y'all's ears off long enough. I want to keep my vlogs right around 10 to 12 minutes because I know that when I watch vlogs, I don't want to watch a vlog for like 20 odd minutes. So I just leave it about 10 and that would be the end of it. But like I said, I'm not good with editing right now. So it's just going to be one straight vlog until I can get a camera, until I can get everything onto my laptop and get everything kind of worked out. But I will let everybody go. And I love y'all and I will talk to y'all tomorrow. Bye.